Now in this lecture we'll be starting with Python anatomy and we'll be first of all covering how comments are defined in Python and what are import statements. So in order to comment a line you just need to type hash. So basically these are Unix based statements. In Unix we have the hash used as comment to comment a particular line or command like in cron jobs and all. So here also we are following the same pattern and whenever you have to comment something you can just type hash before that and that line will be treated as a comment. Now you might come across certain comments which are at the top of the page with this signature that is the file will have this statement at the beginning of the file and these will be the two characters that will appear first. This is known as shebang line and these are usually used to define the interpreter path that the file will use to execute the code. But here we don't need it. was just interested in giving you the detail about different types of comments that you may come across. But the standard is this one, hash and that comment set. Now next we will be covering import statement. Now whenever you have to import some modules from Python or you have to create your own and then import it in some other file, you make use of import statement. So we say import and then the name of the module which you want to import. For instance over here we'll say platform. Now platform is the basic module that comes with Python and one can make use of this platform module to get the Python version that is installed. In order to do that we'll be making use of the print command and here inside print we'll have platform dot and then we'll have the Python version. So here you can see the IntelliSense is giving me the Python version link. There we have it and since this is a method we'll have it as a bracket and that's pretty much it. Let's save this and run this file now. Here you can see the version is printed as 3.7.4 and then the next message hello world is printed. So we can have multiple modules imported using the single import command or we can have multiple imports for specific modules that we want to import in our Python script. On the next one we'll be taking a look at expressions and statements in Python.